手置きを見せてやる Alright, so in this one, we are going to be using Goku Vegeta, as I have been using、uh, all these Dragon Ball Super S related units to Dragon Ball Super movies, obviously because we have Super Hero coming out in less than two weeks at this point. I do want to go through them as, you know, as hype as they were, and on hype, like Game 1 is very on hype compared to Game 2 because what actually happens in the movie, Goku Vegeta obviously a very hype unit. But just before we get into that, I do want to mention, um, So, multiverses. Obviously, it's in my background a lot. I've been playing a lot. I'm trying to get better.、Uh, I play Superman personally. I know he's very edge campy, and then, you know, like I understand the mechanics of him, right? What he wants to do and how to play him. And I feel like I understand him well enough. Maybe not to edge camp and just be like, you know, that annoying guy, but enough to, like, you know, do well, win 1v1s. I'm flawless in 1v1s. 2v2s, it's hard because, you know, <laughs> it's 2v2s. It's 2v2, right? And Iron Giants just don't get me started on them. But, look, I've never done this before. And I want to do this now.、Um, so, how I'm going to compare this, I guess, and compromise this would be a like goal? I don't know how else to do this to be like, do you guys want this content or not? I don't know. Like, I would, like I'll ask you, then it's like, okay, well, here's 50 people that said yes. Well, I need to know if there's more, right? I don't want 50 people to just watch it, obviously. So, if you guys do want multiverse content,、uh, what's the average likes I get? I don't know. If you guys want multiverse content, let's get this video to 508 likes. I, I genuinely don't know. I feel like GV's hype. People are going to watch this more. I feel like this is a good intro to it. If you guys want multiverses, let me know. I will upload it. Probably like a third video just because it'll be in between. It wouldn't, you know, again, it wouldn't do well. I don't really care if it does well. I'm just excited about Legends stuff. And I'm down at Legends as much as it is、uh, annoying. It is still a good game in overall sense compared to a lot of other mobile gacha games, especially PvP based ones. So、uh, if you guys want to see Multiverses again,、uh, like the video, I guess I feel very sellout-y sell e saying that. But yeah, that's the only way I can garner who would actually care enough for it.、Uh, I see. A lot of、uh, support for it, like people still talking about it, even when I don't mention it. Like, see in the background, I'm just like, people have to be interested at this point. They are interested. So, I'm not the greatest. I'm forewarning, I, I suck, but in comparison, I don't think I'm the worst in the world. So, guys, want to see it, let me know. We will have it on the channel probably within this next week. We probably have a lot of stuff coming this week, so maybe on the weekend, but you know, it could happen. Again, we'll kind of garner the opinions of everybody if you guys want to see it, right? Obviously, spreading out games is something I want to do eventually. And this seems to be a game people enjoy just on their own and talking about. So, multiverses, if you guys want to see it again, slap the like. But, God, I feel sad at least. Sell out E. I can't speak saying that. But, GV,、uh, so this is the team I'm going to use. And、uh, which, which direction is it? No, it's the other direction, huh? This is the team that、uh, a BR55 that is, you know, barely hitting the top 10K within the first week is going to tell you GV is top three in the game. And I used mono purple for them. And they were. Four eggs and Kai buffed, and they carried the shit out of me with double supports because Super Joe is basically support, and I have Blue Vegeta is only a support unit, right? Well, that's the BR55 team. You know, I would use that, but I actually want to win matches against people that are actually better ranked, so we are going to run them on movies because, well, don't really have a good home. GV are very paper thin. They do have sustainability with healing, obviously, while doing arts on Goku or Vegeta.、Uh, you know, opposite the and not opposite, but like. Different than the androids, where they only heal when 17 or 18, or 17 rather, lands arts GV, do card. Kind of like Dragon Fist, do card, heal. Big simple stuff there. So, they do have some sustainability, but in overall sense, they are not in a great spot. They do need to be Zenkai buffed. Like, if I want to have any defensiveness on them at all, I need them Zenkai buffed. So, what I was thinking was, I gotta run them here. Because if I run them on Godaki, I'm forced to run in UI. I don't wanna run in UI. I don't like using him because he's just a boring unit. Even if you play him aggressive link, he's just very boring to play with and against.、Uh, so I don't wanna run him、and、on top of the Zenkai buffs, would be more blast based because it'd be Murtsumasu. Maybe that purple Vegeta, but he's low Z ability.、Um, it just wouldn't work out for everybody, right? Because again, Vegeta can also be blast based like, on the swap out. So it's like, I want double attack from the Zenkai buff, which. Purple Roly supplements as well.、Uh, team wise, obviously, again, movies with Tapion, who's going to be just I've been mean, used a lot. He's a very good support. He's universal support. If you're uni universal support, a good color,、uh, what you know, like, big drawback do I have to not use you, right? So we're going to use him here. GV, obviously, Dragon Fist, just because, well, he can sustain as well, and he's cool, and he's new, and he's 14 stars, and he's an LF. That's about all. Again, there's always Dragon Fist Slander, so maybe amending that will be something here. Bench wise, we do have GB, who is double attack, Purple Broly, who is double attack, and then Zenkai buffing、uh, Goku Vegeta there. Goku, who is HP and strike attack. 
Again, another double tag here from Dragonfist Goku, and I believe GD's actually double tag and then strike defense to Vegeta Clan, Sun Family, or God. He obviously tape on leader slot there, and then tape on getting double defense and uh, strike attack to everybody because he is leader slotted. Uh, Dragonfist also getting 3% to strike our stand afflicted, which is nice for the Goku variant, obviously. Goku is more strike base, Vegeta is more blast base. The opposite with the androids, 18 is more strike base. 17 more blast base, you leave it 17 always. So that's how that's going to work out. Just to look at GV's stats, uh, stats right here, they should be vibing. I did actually get one more star on them because that one banner with the tickets from, I believe, the co-op shop, right? You would do the co-ops and get the tickets from there. You probably don't even have it yet because I just grind the shit out of the raid, but, or not the raid, the uh, Z power for all the uh, raspberry squads. So I had that already and uh, got another star on them here up to 11. So it should be eating, you know, 11 is kind of a little bit of a jump, it's not that big of a jump from like 7 to 9, but it's a little bit of a jump, and uh, 246, 245, 165, 164, just to compare to Dragonfist, who doesn't really have the greatest stat spread on his at least defense, his offenses are okay, but yeah, uh, defensively, they're gonna compare at 14 stars, which, if you know GB squishy, you know Dragonfist is squishy, you kind of can see the issue there. Strike attack very much higher than blast attack is about even, but he is more strike based anyways. GV, obviously how they work is they lead with purple, meaning they are advantage to greens, a disadvantage to yellow, and then you reverse that. So if you're advantage to green, disadvantage to yellow, and now advantage to yellow, disadvantage to green. Obviously that is what the attack mechanic is. It is a reversal opportunity for your other unit. Again, tag back, you just maintain what you had. So the units around him, right now, he's disadvantage Tapion, advantage Dragon Fist, we'll reverse that, it would be advanced Tapion, disadvantage to Dragon Fist. Get it? Got it? Good. Because I know people get confused on tag mechanics, so I feel like explaining it is very useful for some people. And then, equip-wise, again, we know what GV does. They want to heal, they want to do arts, they want to just build up and keep swapping in and out and out to build up blue card damage. Obviously, they have a lot of stuff in their kit that they can do with the green card, destroying enemies' card, getting cover null, you know, all these things, getting vanish back, you know, again, all these things. You do want to land them all, but equip-wise, just because we don't want to go over all their kit, we all know what GV does. This one here, Double Strike Attack and Spell Shoot Damage. I actually do have an equip that's some health store, but I think the third equip's actually health store, so I'll just give them that so that blue card actually hits harder. This one here, which is Double Defense, then Pure Strike when Vegeta Clans Bell Member. Um, we have... Actually, no, I'll change that. I had the movies pure. I forgot I had the movies pure. But nonetheless, we do have Vegeta anyways, because obviously Vegeta, Goku Vegeta. And then we do have the third one, which is Health Store, Strike Attack, Blast Events, and Blast Attack there. More Blast Space in the uh, Switch perspective. Again, we do have all double attacks abilities across three units, so that's the premise of that there. So we can actually maintain Vegeta doing good damage on top of, uh, whatchamacallit, um... Goku doing good damage because we do have, you know, some strike tags abilities on the double attack. And then this movie pure because all movies, 15% pure instead of 12% pure. With that being said, let's get into the matches and see how uh, Goku Vegeta can do in PvP. They look pretty damn hot there. Wow, they look pretty damn nice in that art. First match up against Future. Well, let's see some. Alrighty, we saw something. And now we see everything. Hell. Oh boy. I'm gonna stay quiet for this one. Just let it happen. You have another boss. Oh. Tap again. Okay, so I got PV there, not gonna lie. Pretty scared. Ambitious. Ambition is the best thing to do. Oh, I sidestepped. Well, I guess not. <laughs> Next time, I'll try better to. It's blast here. Surely you won't jump. Single tap. Interesting. I mean, makes sense. Keep going with Mr. Dragon Fist here, and just... Oh, pop off, I really... Oh, we'll go tape you on. Throw this. Stall out for a second, because I need to swap. Is that a blast? It's tap. Oh yeah, forgot you could do that. Silly me. You don't have any strikes unlocked. Okay, uh, we have cover null here. So we could actually just do this. Androids? That's fine. Good damage. Yeah, that's pretty good damage. Nice, GV. I'll take that. Oh boy. I'm scared. I'm scared. Scary situation got over. Uh, we do have a rush in the hand. I also have my big boom hit, which is really what I needed here, because I do two more cards and I'll get this here. 
I don't think you'll swap. I think you're scared. Okay, you're dead. Walk in. Okay. Not, not too shabby. Mr. Dragon Fist. Your advantage is gone. Pop. I thought you'd swap. Okay. Interesting. I thought you'd swap there. Well, I'm scared. Don't mind me. Why did I actually... I clicked the rush, but I didn't hold it down because I didn't want to actually use it. Uh, I should have just used it there. Okay. That was dumb. I got anxious. Yeah. Goodbye, Tapion. Be seeing you. Woo! No, Tapion. I'm way too gassing Tapion. Tapion's dead. <laughs> yeah, Tapion's dead. Okay. Um. Strikes are sealed. I'm gonna tackle? He's gonna do a blast. <sighs> Fuck it! Oh boy. Rush? No, no rush there. Interesting. Now what happens? Your ultimate wouldn't kill. Maybe it'll just stall out until Super Cheeto's back, right? Oh, you didn't. Play another card. Okay. That's interesting. I think I could swap to Vegeta if I get a combo going here. I think. It's a lot of damage. God damn. Oh, nice. Alright, can I swap? I can't swap yet. Surely you won't swap here. Okay. We'll do one more card. Mm-hmm. Should be able to swap at this point. Yes, sir. Is that something crazy? No. That was a very important catch. Nice. Health store is down as well. Oh, that's good. We have cover null. Yep, cover null. Thank you. Appreciate it. Gonna blast here. Oh, really? Okay. That's fine. Oh my god, type neutral go crazy. And you're neutral. Are we not rushing? Oh, the neutral ended. Thank you. We won't rush, I guess. That's fine. Why did I slice that? Clash. Ugh. Please! Oh! <laughs> you know what? Ah. Oh. It's a close match. Fuck it. We'll keep it in. Fuck it. I don't like keeping it in first match losses because that's a bad precedent, but it was a close match. Maybe very good units all around. Yeah, all, I mean, yeah. All around very good units. Probably my team at the worst for GV, but... Fuck it. Good match. Could have... It could have gone better. I just fucked up that one. That one situation, I got hesitant on the rush. I didn't know. I don't know. Because I could have rushed Vegito there, but then I could. He had endurance, but I should have just thrown it because I don't really care about the endurance. I don't know. Because I had the blue cards in hand. Like, ah, uh, that was just dumb. I just played way too dumb there. There's a slow brain going on for me. Oh, well. Good match. That sucks. Unfortunate. Oh, well. Uh, Sun Family, right? Yes. It was a weird data update that just happened, which was, again, weird. Oh, nice. Got that out of the way. Good wait there. Uh, we'll let you go because, well, I need you to build up. I don't really mind GV taking a backseat here. Obviously, I need kind of both aspects of GV in this match because, well, you know, there's a green, there's a yellow. You need to be able to maintain against both ends of those units. Pretty good damage. It's pretty damn solid. So two units there? Did below like 40% on two units? It's pretty damn good. Take that. Uh, your side stepping so I'll just throw this blast out. Sure, why not? This turns into Dragonfish Showcase by accident. I do apologize, but I'm not opposed to it. Nice PV. Oh, okay, weird. Interesting. Will you go for anything crazy? You actually went for a blast. That's interesting. Why? You only had blast in hand, I guess? That's weird. You had a green card. Could on the green. I guess you just spawned it, maybe? Huh. Catch. Goodbye. Alrighty. Good stuff, GV! Got a blue card off. It's all I needed. That worked. Okay, Dragonfist, you wrap this man up. Oh my god, he died so quickly. Is that a low star for Aku? It's gotta be. Oh, you're dead. I don't know how I was fully built up. Good luck. Yeah, goodbye. Uh, this should kill. 2.3, I have... 
I think I have the Awakened Time to Go Wild, which is an old damage equip, and I have the Righteous Saiyan. When I don't hear it, like, the noise of it hitting, doing, like, damage on it, like the critical or just normal damage, so happy because I have to get to see this ultimate. I love how this looks at the end end. Again, that's literally the summon animation, but this... I think everyone loves this scene. The only scene that really mattered in Wrath of the Dragon. It's right there. Good first match. Pretty solid second match. Um, what was the stars there? I do wonder. Let me check. I wonder what my match history is. I haven't played all day. I just played multiverses all day. <laughs> or I just go out, but it was hella rainy today. Um, what was the stars on your team? That was an 8 star 4 2. He was getting melted like butter. I, I wouldn't even say that's a big star differential. I mean, yes, 14 star Dragon Fist, I understand it, but like, he's building up cut from his allies he's already getting hit. I mean, I got his ass beat prior too, so. I actually thought he'd be tanking a lot better. Alright, Dragon Fist with uh, these equips, I guess, does a lot more damage. I had him before, kind of double health restore area esque. I changed it over to this, where it's double strikes that double health store with the plat. Uh, just one health store with the Awakened Time to Go Wild. Obviously, that's pretty ideal for him. Pretty solid change, as the outcome shows here. Red, red, purple. Uh, well, not having a blue, <laughs> it's not great to this situation for me here. Uh, if that weren't obvious, that's kind of a waste of a vanish for me, I'm going to be real. But... We got something going, and I'm going to throw this blue card because you're going to swap to somebody. Shocking, I was correct. Goddamn, yeah, GB still hits hard. Like, that's MUI on boost. Like, that's not... Like, that's ridiculous, actually. You really did? Oh, no, here we go. <laughs> he even dropped. <laughs> he even dropped combo for no reason in particular. He just dropped combo. All right, well, I guess he knew I'd no vanish, right? Now we just, uh, we just let this happen. I guess. I have to waste both cover nulls. That's so sad. Mm -hmm. Can it be a green card again? It can't. Alright. <laughs> oh my god! He's got fucking incinerated! He just got incinerated back. All right, we're doing a lot of damage on this team, at least. I'm gonna pop me in, get a little bit of a healer. Your strikes and blaster sealed. Okay. I didn't really think much was going to go on there, but I was a little bit spooked out. Please don't swap. Cool. We do have Cover Null with Goku here, right? I don't think so. We don't. Goku does not get Cover Null on that. Fun fact. <laughs> now we know. I don't mind rushing Whis at all in any circumstance. Whis is uh, annoying. So it's fine. I'll get that off, and uh, we should be in a better spot. Not really ideal, but we can get, you know, drag for the situation, kind of like force kill a unit with the ultimate, but we gotta get there, right? Good stuff so far, GB. They're hitting hard. Again, there's Zenkai buff, but movies to double tag Z ability anyways, so it's not like it's arbitrary. Like, I'm not forcing the Zenkai buff on every other unit that's like, oh my god, I don't want this, but like, they're all movies. They all, like, like the Zenkai buff. They don't care. Okay. Okay. I'm gonna tap. PB. Spooky. Spooky. Do you lose your MUI? Do you lose your androids? What are you doing? Yeah, I would do the same thing. Well, your greens and blues are sealed, so let's just go for this. And you have another blast, right? Yep. Strike. 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 And now your strike sealed. All right. The tape round's pretty good to counter out the droid's annoyingness mechanic of, uh, well, this fucking team. You can't do anything here. You lose. Red, red, purple taken down. GB's hitting hard. That blue card did a lot. Like, I'm assuming this is a Zenkai buff team because it's red, red, purple. You usually do that. And, uh, that blue card did a lot of damage with no switching, just Tapion swapping, which is, like, I'm running Tapion on every setup I can because he's just that goaded. Uh, that was a lot of damage. Great. I, I'm not really shocked. I'm just more impressed. Nice. GB can still hit hard. They take a fuck ton. They can hit hard. Also, that that blast did a lot from the androids. They had to be double Zenkai buff there, right? Because they did a lot on Dragon Fist. I don't think they had blast armor. Maybe. Why wouldn't they? They have everything. Maybe. A little bit suspect of this. The team seems fine, star like barely fine, star wise. But uh, those equips, I, I see a B equip there, and you know I'm not that harsh to judge, but like a B equip this high up, like that's 
That's not normal. I, I could say that with confidence, right? Maybe I can't say much else, but that's not normal. Let's see a big clip this high up. All right. Well, he plays like he knows what he's doing, so I don't know. I'm just a little bit confused. Do I have enough key for this, or am I going to get auto-dodged on? Auto-dodged. No, he actually dodged, which is smart, because then he can combo me. Now what happens? I have another strike, hopefully. You do. Let's back you up. Let's go for a strike. Cancel it out. There's an ambulance coming in the background. As always, the weekends go crazy on it. Obviously. That was... Okay, you do a lot of questionable plays, like a mid-range strike there, where you really didn't need to. Hmm. I don't know what to think so far. It feels like nothing fishy is going to happen, but... Really? Why? How come? How many ambu- I hear three! My ears are so big, I can hear everything. That's fine, it's just... Why- why Beerus? I'm confused? I'm more confused than anything. Don't really care that he did it, I'm just confused why he did it. Okay. Oh, pop the green. Sure. Okay. I guess you want the heal? I'll wait for you. You should be dead here. Yes, sir. Mr. Catman down where he should have been already. I'm dashing forward if it does register it. Oh. I guess not. Um, I have, no, I have genuinely no idea. I don't know what to pick against. We see spawns green cards, maybe green cards. Oh, well. Got my rush guest, unfortunate, but we should be all right here. Just don't sell my Dragon Fist, which is... Easier said than done, I guess, but it's not difficult in any manner, right? Shouldn't be, at least. Tackle here. No. Do I still have cover null? I can't see with all the debuffs. Uh, he spawned two right there? Jeez, that's good RNG. The fact that he spawned two cards right there in that time frame? It's very good RNG. I think this is just worth it. It kills Whis. And if it doesn't kill Whis, then you swap and then you die. Okay. Yeah, This is worth it. Fuck it. I'd rather just get a confirm. Should have kill. I know it's not type neutral, but it should have kill. Yeah, okay. Let's go for this. Fuck it. Okay. If you want to have Tapion, I'm actually going to let you do some hits so I can just use the ability to heal. All right. Um, you can have Tapion. I don't think you'd kill with an ult from full. I don't think you'd kill. Especially with combo comp. Yeah, you're not going to try it. No point. I'm just going to wait. I don't mind. No mind or matter here. And yeah, I don't know why. <laughs> You're going for mid-range strikes, which is very interesting, because you really don't need to go for anything there, but uh... Interesting match. I don't really know what was fully going on this match. I feel like it was just kind of like wandering, but... You got this high up. You can't be that bad if you get high up, right? You just play a lot. Who knows? Uh, very much wandering match, though. GV, unfortunately, bit the bullet early, but... Still doing good damage, which is what I want to see. I wish they lived longer for sure, but can't control a rush when it is uh, landed against you, unfortunately. Fusions. There's another ambulance. <laughs> New York, man. New York. Oh, wait. This is a little bit, uh, if you can't tell, there's a little bit of delay in this match. <laughs> just, just a tad. Oh, I couldn't even dash backwards. That's how delayed this is, huh? I can't, I can't tell what's happening. I, I, I wish I knew what was going on. That, that'd be great, but, uh... No, I got, I got no real perspective of what's happening in this match. Can I go into my Vegeta after this card, please? And thank you, I couldn't draw a card. Okay. I drew a blue card, that's cool. I'm just gonna stand here. Hello? He full screen striked. That's definitely a play to make. I wouldn't recommend it, personally. I'm not, you know, that type of guy to recommend full screen striking, but it, it's a play you can do. I just wouldn't do it myself, personally. Swap, blast. Oh, boy. Maybe you'll think it's a blue card for some reason. Yeah, why would you? Why would you? That'd be dumb, honestly. Um, no. Kill your strikes. Also, I don't mind that card reload, basically, like, oh, because I had no Dragon Balls anywhere. Tap. Tap again. Okay. 
Okay. Okay. I'm waiting. Let's go. Ah, oh, shucks. Well, that's not good. Um, GB. Swap? Perhaps? Today? Maybe? Great. <laughs> I thought I clicked my character earlier. I thought incorrectly. This will kill GB. They are paper, so that's unfortunate. It's unfortunate. I just wish my swap went earlier. Again, there is some just innate delay. This match it's not obvious enough. You could see it literally where my character's trying to jump. If nothing else, the main was used early, so I guess that's uh, helpful to me. Not really, but some silver lining would be that. You did that too late, didn't you? Yep. And now we just go, and you die. That's not something you wanted, I can tell. Okay. I wouldn't mind rushing this first life if I get the opportunity to. I'm actually just going to tackle. He has no cards there. Okay, cool. I'm going to throw this blue card. Didn't PV me. Didn't sidestep. Do something. Okay. Not that, preferably. <laughs> if there was anything else I would have took in it, because I would have just rushed, but fuck it. Oh, that was dumb of me. I should have just anticipated that. Oh, really? Okay. Pretty bad there. I was going to say, did he uh, cancel my cover null? No, he can't do that. I'm going to let him take it. I just don't want to get a situation where I get caught with Dragon Fist. I can't let that happen. The, the match depends on Dragon Fist at the end here. At the end of the day, it's all up to him. Okay. It's very... I do not like this at all. Fuck me. Please. You can't swap. There is no way. And if you do, you die. He should die here. 1.1 is not much with zero combo comp. I know, again, we're not neutral, but... This seems like confirm. Yeah, not that confident, but uh, more confident than. I mean, I would no normally be on that. We should. We have double card speed at this point, right? Ten counts after main. Uh, we should easily be able to kill the first life, then rush the second life here, right? Maybe we can just kill flat out because we're again double card speed. We'll do this blast to get the first life out of the way because our blasts are weaker, and then we will attempt to continue here. If the delay wants to end for one millisecond. That'd be great. Do we have enough? Nah, I'm not going to risk it. I'm not going to risk some stupid shit there going wrong. Hopefully don't get against a blue card, but... If it happens, it happens. What are you going to do? It didn't happen. Great. It sucks GV dies early. Because GV can make these opportunities good. I mean, if you're good enough... I can't even say that. If you're good enough to get rushed, I was going to say, you might have more value than, like, intrinsically what I thought. But are they good enough to get rushed? I wouldn't say they're the most needed to get rushed, but they are definitely a comeback unit. No, they can't pull it off. They haven't, because they keep getting rushed, but, uh, they could. Kind of sucks they didn't live that. You would think, you know, an 11-star, basically, red unit in that circumstance, because Vegeta's obviously advantage to Vegito in that spot, uh, you would live it, but, uh, no, 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 not even close. And we do have an HP bench. It's not like I'm not giving them HP. No health restore, no HP on the actual, like, equipments, but... You have health to store anyways. Why would you need HP on the equipment? It's like, you don't really need both a lot of time. You just need one or the other. Obviously, if the unit heals by doing things, health to store. Makes sense, right? Unfortunate. Now they're getting just clobbered earlier on, but I do see potential. This isn't really a terrible team for them. Again, I don't think they're needed. They're not really a purple you want to use right now, but there's potential existing. And I feel like if that's there, that's enough. Again, I don't think there's some god tier, god -tier unit, but they're fine to use. It's not like you're going to throw the match because you use GV. Probably have a decent chance of winning with it. This is... I don't know. Good units. Okay. Whatever it is, it's something. That lands. Cool. I'm going to pop main, right? No, it's 10 counts. I'm dumb. I mean, if you want to play a passive game, I'll play a passive game. I don't mind. I'm, I'm down. Personally, I don't mind at all. Yeah, let's go Dragon Fist and all these blasts, huh? Alrighty, I guess I can't get cover changed, but uh, can't get cover changed any ways. Okay. okay. 
Well, it worked out, but, um, yeah, if I didn't have 97 of the same card that I didn't want, um, and then draw a green card there, I'd be in a better spot, <laughs> positionally-wise. <laughs> Maybe. Perhaps. We should have enough key to do this, right? Barely enough? Yep. Get our Vanish back. This is purple to a yellow, and it's really not the worst. I'm pretty sure it's a 14-star Ultra Vegito as well. Obviously, we're Vanish here now. Yep. Did it in time. Wow. Surprising. Tap again. Really? Interesting. To just risk your unit, stay in there. It's gonna be another blast here. You have a rush? That'd be bad. Oh, well, at least I predicted it. Oh, uh, fuck it. Okay. Can this go badly? And I sure hope not. Uh, we have cover and all, so it's not like we're in a bad spot here. Frieza can come in, Vegito come in, whatever. Should be fine. Interesting swap there. I mean, I, I'm... Whoever you choose to sack for this, it's fine. Revival? I kind of figured it'd be him. Vegito, you want to just let him endure. And I guess the point of this would be to let Vegito live longer because you have a revival unit. I, I guess. I, I, again, don't really know the premise of this team. It just kind of is here. Maybe it's P.O. with Vegito? I saw Cell on the team, so again, I'm confused. Like, what, what's the premise of this? But it something. This guy's 20k RP. Can't be bad, right? This is A-OK. -okay. Obviously, you're neutral, which is a problem, but we can get over this little hurdle here. I sure hope. And there's the hurdle getting over. Alrighty. And at this point, you are dead. Whoever you choose to die is dead. So, you enjoy that. Frieza. I kind of figured it'd be Frieza, but you never know. Maybe the androids get sacked off for some stupid reason, because that'd just be dumb, but, you know. Nothing there for them. Nice. Apology. Blue card should do nice. I'd like to go into GV if possible. I do have a green card for him, so they could combo extend, which would be very clean for us. Here's gonna... Alright. It's not gonna do much. I mean... The best play to make is not to do much, technically. Yeah. And that was the play to do. That's fine. Uh, it's not good. I wouldn't say it's particularly good, but it's fine. Because they can heal. It's not too bad. Draw a blue card. Oh, really? Nice. Oh, you didn't... Did you forget Tapion could do his little magic thing? <laughs> of the lowering sub count by 10? Maybe you forgot? Possibly? Am I going to guess you here? No. So you picked green card because you had a green card to use on the rush, huh? Hmm. Um, tackling should be safe. Obviously, I don't have any cover nulls, but I can't lock you in. I do have the blue card, which is something. Tell me you don't show my blue card with this kill. Tell me my blue card stays and I can tackle you, get your vanish out, then blue card and kill you. Tell me that's my setup right now. Please. Okay. Being patient there definitely didn't matter. I can't confirm that. That's not fortunate for us, actually. It's pretty unfortunate. This should be able to give a situation to just kill because you can't swap yet. All right. Vegito's dead. Beautiful. Honestly, beautiful. Thank you, Dragonfish, for just clutching the shit out of that on the kill. And now we kind of have to just let you take a hit. Yeah, this is fine. I have... But, like, there's nothing I could do with that spot. I'm not going to just risk a double vanish and lose GB because I'm too, like... Stupid to let my unit take a hit. We want to vanish back in time. Just had a green card in hand. Did you just do a blue card? I don't remember. This combo's gonna go on for a good while. Yeah. <laughs> it's still gonna go on, yeah. Yeah. Pretty solid unit there. <laughs> Pretty solid, but uh should be alright. I don't think we actually win it here, but not in the worst spot. Can't really go to GV. I wanna be safe and I wanna win this match if possible. So we'll vibe out. Okay, last again. Okay. Nice. Green card? Mmm, I didn't click it in time, huh? Do you have more? No, you don't. Let's swap. Just for heal's sake. Nice. Good stuff there. Almost had a double rush as well. Well, just got one, actually. Hey, give me the LF. Good sport. Solid. Solid. 
Um, Dragonfist is really doing a lot of work here, which I'm happy to see. Again, I like seeing our boy Dragonfist. No Zenkai buffs, nothing artificial for him. He's just vibing. I really want to give him a Zenkai bench of DBZ Broly, because obviously he's double defense, and respectfully, GV need defenses as much as they can get. But I'm really focused firing the offense on this team. Again, we have two units that can auto-heal by doing their arts. Again, just doing, not even landing. Then tape on your team heals. I feel like it's worthwhile to just run this, but if it's working... And this is the outcome. I mean, maybe it's actually a setup that people could run. Tapion, people probably own. Dragonfist, maybe you don't own them. Then run, I mean, just a good third. Just run Ultra Gogeta. Like, just lead us out Ultra Gogeta. Tapion's missing out on giving his extra strike attacks the ability. It's fine. Just miss that out. It doesn't matter too much. And then, uh, I guess it's GV, but if you want to run somebody else, just use Rabble Gohan, then boom, you're kind of vibing. And a lot of offensive bench. Rabble Gohan doubles, you know, you get Zenkai buff there from, uh, Broly, Gogeta, Blue Soul, Double Attack, Gokua, Strike Attack, and HP. Like, it's a very offense-heavy team. We have some defense from Tapion, but, like, that's really it. Then the Zenkai buff to GV, but they're not. They're not going to tank. Like, sorry, they're not going to tank. Last match up against uh, MUI with Ultra Gogeta, and I don't really know what this is. What is this? God Key with Ultra Gogeta. Can even... Saiyans? Green card? Okay, great. Uh, I definitely have enough key for that, surely. Somewhere in my inventory. Besides that. Yeah. Oh, you thought I had vanished back? No, uh, I'm dumb. I just threw away like an idiot. Don't mind me. Clearly can't swap out here. Shucks! Should have done better there. That's good. Take that. Ah, uh, you're dead. And if you're not dead, Vegeta's not back. No, it would take five cards to get Vegeta back. He's not back. Really? I I, I, I agree with that, actually. I was going to say I don't agree with that, but I agree with that, yeah. Again, Vegeta wasn't back, so it's like you have to sack off either him or uh, Gogeta there. And uh, neither are a good option, but you know, one's better than the other, probably. Let's do Strike, and now I will Rush. Probably don't think I have... A blue card, considering I did one, but GV kind of likes the idea of blue cards. Maybe, who knows. I'll take this, though. Pretty solid last match, just uh, easy going here, so far. So far. Being incorrect kind of, you know, hurts that. Oh, that's bad! Ha! <laughs> really bad! Really bad! Oh, nice, good wait. <laughs> now it happens. Good luck, me in. Actually, I prefer if you don't. Will you kill him? You have another card, right? You don't. You don't kill. No, you don't kill. And I could pop this maze, did a blue card, you don't have another blue card, so I could just vibe out. But, yeah, unfortunately, I guess the, the uh, roller coaster downhill definitely did happen there. That's nice for you. Pop this, see what's going on. Not much. And you went for a mid range strike for whatever reason. I don't really know. Uh, works out for me, though, because you will lose your. Star Spangled Units there. Goodbye. Probably didn't want him to die, right? Yeah, probably not. Sure. Oh, did you just give up? No, I thought you gave up. <laughs> probably not a good idea to go for a full screen strike uh, because you thought they gave up. Yeah, I, yeah, maybe. Maybe should have thought that through a little bit better. Another blue card. From where? You didn't do any cards with GV. Or not GV, uh, Ultra Gogeta. How'd you get another? Hmm. Interesting. Uh, you'll die here. Yep, nice. Overall, not too shabby. I guess you have to build them in a very often like, double down their glass cannony manner and give them all the abilities for double offense. I just kind of whacked the team together thinking, look, they can hurt people, so why not let them hurt people? I thought maybe I should cater to the defense a little bit more to kind of give them some sustainability, but they're sustained in their health restores, so maybe it's better to build them just full offense. I don't really... No, again, this is probably the most ideal team you could run for them if you're going to run GV anywhere. You're not running Mono Purple, just too spooky with uh, Vegito, Tapion, you know, Angel Golden Frieza, these greens and yellows that are running around. And uh, you're way too reliant on one unit because Super Vegito is just a support unit of that team. Super Saiyan Blue Vegito literally is a support unit. And then just have GV. And if you lose GV, then what do you have? You have nothing. You lose the match, right? But here, obviously, you do have Tapion who could do very well. You have Dragonfist who can go neutral on at least one spot. Move Vanish kind of clutch up in spots if you do have them in a uh, nice manner of build up, which 
prioritizing his buildup is very important, right? But overall, GV did pretty solid. Let me guys think of Goku Vegeta, and I'll see you guys in the next one.